Hi guys, this is your boy Emmanuel and welcome back to yet another video from me. And today we are going to look at a screen recorder uh, called Cyberlink Screen Recorder. As I already installed the Cyberlink Screen Recorder, I'm just going to double click here to open the screen recorder. Alright, so this is the Cyberlink Screen Recorder and we've got different options with the screen recorder. It comes in handy for people who stream and record their videos with the screen. In the home screen, the software allows you to set up your screen resolution. I'm gonna choose 1080p. And I also have a video frame rate of 120 frames per second. I'll just keep it to 30 frames per second to give you a faster output. All right, if you want the mouse clicks to be recorded, just click there and you can actually select which color to be shown while you click the mouse every time i think yellow is good all right so if you want to choose full screen then these are the options you can actually lock the screen to an application when you open an application you can just lock to an application using this feature and can actually click on the custom area to actually uh, choose the area of screen recording this is a cool feature as well so all right if you want to record something from a device you can always connect the device to a HDMI cable to your PC and start recording the device uh, which is probably an external uh, DSLR camera or some kind of other device once you choose the device you can actually select the name of the device I do have a webcam here that is not actually required so in case if you connect your system to a DSLR you can do that here as well all right I'll stick with the full screen here for the moment all right so the next thing is I'm gonna set up my webcam I'm just gonna click on ok and here it gives me an option to select the webcam i'm just going to click on webcam and just choose hd camera here as you can see it shows a preview of my screen here all right so that looks fantastic i'll just close it out and this is the maximum resolution of my camera and frame rate if you use a powerful hd camera for your screen recording of course you can connect that camera and choose the appropriate resolution and in case if you want to add a chroma key to your webcam video feed you can do this here as well you can, and you can eliminate the green screen if you want for now I'll uncheck this box all right having added my webcam I'm just gonna click on ok so I have a preview of my webcam shown here all right, the next thing that I'm gonna do here is to choose my audio preferences. So I'm gonna click on the down arrow button here and I'm gonna choose the microphone that I'm being using right now. All right, if you see here, it was already been selected. And this gives you an option to actually show any video overlays that you want to do. So I'm just gonna click on plus and if i do have an image i can insert the image you know i could actually show you that i can just use one picture as a background and I can, i'm gonna choose the snowflakes and i'm gonna click okay so i've added a video overlay to my webcam here and if you want to preview what the actual output is gonna be you just can click on the preview button here and as you can see behind my webcam feed there is a image overlay so this can be done using cyberlink screen recorder which is a fantastic option all right i'll close the preview also i could set up a time limit the time limit is set to one hour now if you want to do a scheduled one hour recording you can do this here as well so this is a fantastic feature of cyberlink screen recorder i'll disable this for now 
I'm just gonna hit record and there you go the recording has started and we have started recording the screen so guys cyberlink screen recorder is a very useful very resourceful screen recorder it has got plenty of options where you could actually set a time limit and record the screen with a background image so i think that's pretty cool all right i'll pause the recording in case if you want to stop the recording for a while and then go somewhere and come back and finish the recording you can do that by pausing it and again clicking on resume if you don't want you can just click on the stop button here and there you go immediately as you can see here the output video has been loaded and the destination folder has already opened here as well so uh, this is a fantastic feature guys so I'm just gonna look at the preview all right the video output is pretty fantastic I'm just gonna close this so the video output is pretty good guys so it's pretty straightforward where you can actually record your screens and unfortunately there is no editor options in the screen recorder so if they would have allowed us to actually record the screen it would have been fantastic guys but uh, unfortunately that's not an option with cyberlink screen recorder maybe you should download a cyberlink uh, video editor to do that so that is a bummer guys that is where pepper cloud comes in handy where you could actually record your videos on the go stream it as well and once you have finished the recording you could always edit the recording as well so my personal favorite is pepper cloud and it lets you to edit the videos on the go and share it to any social media platform that you want also it lets you to stream real time so my personal favorite is pepper cloud guys i've included the link in the description please check it out having said that i would like to show you some of the streaming features so i'm just gonna click on stream here and actually you can connect your screen recorder with popular sharing platforms like twitch youtube facebook or if you have some other platforms you can actually connect it as well just have to select and click on the login button it takes you to through to youtube authorization and once you do that you could set up the video resolution and after everything you can actually enable save stream the video to the disk and then click on go live and ta-da you are live and also while you're live you can actually look at the preview all right i can actually show my click features can you see the click is actually visible that's pretty fantastic guys all right and close the preview now there you go once you click on the live button here you go live and you can start doing your games or you can start streaming what you have to stream guys so it's pretty fantastic but the screen recorder is limited to some features actually you cannot share your videos real time into the social media which is a bummer guys that is where pepper cloud comes into play you can share with people and group all you have to know is their email ids you can actually share it with them or you can actually share it with uh, people on pinterest facebook instagram you can do it on whatever social media that you require by clicking on share on social media options so i think pepper cloud is better than this and my personal favorite is pepper cloud all right guys that is pretty much it the cyberlink screen recorder offer you offers you to record your full screen your game your 
you know you can log the screen recording to an app or you can have custom screen recording or you can actually record from a device so uh, basically uh, we have all the basic recording features now quickly before before ending this video i'm gonna talk to you about the settings i'm gonna click on the settings option here and just these are general application settings where you can actually set up what the ui should look like what should be done after when and you can always uh, set up that the application should be always on top or get minimized after launch you can set up these options and when you go to the file option you can just choose where the output folder has to be that is fantastic and in case if you want to take a screenshot and uh, you know in case some people would, would be using it as a thumbnail so you can do that here as well and when you click on the video option here you can actually set up three monitors which is a fantastic option and you can actually choose record only the selected window you know to do that all right if you talk about the audio option you can check the mic volume here you could set up the mic volume down or high or you can add multiple microphones you know as an input and set up your audio and coming to webcam we've already set up this i've set up an hd camera uh, in case if i want to do a chroma key background you know if i want to delete the background and give you a different background i can do it here by using green screen and i can also set up hotkeys to actually stop the recording stop the recording you know pause the recording all these options i can actually set up my own hotkeys here and delete the hotkeys all right so having said that i'm gonna click on ok i think i've given you a brief overview of cyberlink screen recorder until i see you in the next video it's bye bye from Emmanuel. Take care. If you like my videos, please subscribe and look out for the other videos that I'm gonna post. Thank you for watching.